Here I am going to discuss about a general topic. Some of you may be at the verge of the project dissertation submission or research proposal submission. So here I am going to discuss about how to write a project dissertation or a thesis dissertation. Research dissertation. So there are three main parts for a dissertation. The first one is front material and the second one is main body and the third part is back materials. So what are front materials? We will go through that front materials. Front material, the first one is title page where you are writing the title of your dissertation and your institution will come under that and your name, your affiliation, year of submission and the month of submission, everything will come in that front material. And the second one will be the declaration saying that you have done this project work under the guidance of this uh, professor or this uh, research scientist or you have done at this particular industry and you have not performed this work anywhere else for the uh, proposal of any other project or for the fellowship or something like that. And the third one will be the certificate. This certificate you can get from the industry where you have done the project or else you can get it from the uh, guide where you have done, under whom you have done the project from that particular institution. And the third one, the fourth one is dedication which is an optional page. If you are interested, you can dedicate your dissertation to your family members or you can dedicate to your teachers or you can dedicate to your friends. It is left to you. It is an optional page. And uh, the fifth one is acknowledgement, where you are going to mention about all the names who have helped you throughout the project work or who have helped you throughout your research work. So all the names including your guide name and your friends, everyone's name you can mention in this acknowledgement section. And the next one will be the content where you are going to write a brief description about your dissertation. It means the title of each chapter or each section will be mentioned in that content along with that page number will be mentioned here. And the next one will be the list of abbreviations. So whenever you are using abbreviations in your thesis, First itself you have to define it, afterwards you can keep on using the abbreviation instead of using the full form of that particular word. So you can write all the abbreviations involved in the dissertation. Then the next one will be the list of tables, what are the tables you are including in your dissertation starting from the chapter 1 onwards. You have to list out all the tables at the beginning itself so that people will be understanding which table is present in which chapter and what does it indicate. And the similar way you have to indicate the list of figures also. What are the figures in which chapter it is coming depending on the number of figures and how you have numbered it in each chapter. Like that you are going to write the list of figures here. While coming to the second part of this one, main body, where the first one will be the introduction. So you are going to write the introduction about your dissertation. It can be the introduction to the institution or it can be the introduction to your research work or it can be the introduction to the industry where you have done your project work. And the second one will be the methodology or the procedure. The procedure you have followed for the project work to carry out the project work or the methodology or whatever you have followed throughout your research work that you are going to mention in the second section. And the third one will be analysis of problems or interpretation of data. So whatever the data you are getting here during your project work, that data you are going to interpret and data you are going, the data you are going to discuss in detail. That is what it is mentioned here, interpretation of data. And next one will be summary and conclusions. What is the summary of the entire project work or research work you have done there and what are the main conclusions or major conclusions of your work that is what you are going to express here in this section and then comes the page reference so some people they do references each chapter wise they do the references and some people will keep the reference for the end of the thesis and while coming to the third section of this one project dissertation back materials the first one will be future scope of the work Whatever work you have done, in future, what people can continue with that work. That is what you are going to mention here, future scope of the work. And the next one will be the details of paper published. What are the papers published from the project work you have done or the research work you have done. That is what you are going to mention there. So some people usually 
they put the first page of your uh, first page of their publication at the end of the thesis even that also possible here so you can mention the papers published in which you have to mention about the authors what are the authors present in that title of the paper in which journal it is published and the year of publication then volume page number everything can be mentioned in this section and then comes the details of conference or workshop attended where you are going to mention about the uh, conferences national level or international level conferences you have attended or the workshop something like that you have attended all those things you are going to mention in this back material section and in case if you uh, require any material which is supporting or which is giving evidence for your dissertation that is known as supplementary material even that supplementary material can be uh, attached to the back material or that also comes under back material so here i have mentioned about a few uh, only two three uh, chapters here so depending on the data how much data you have in your uh, uh, this is dissertation depending on that the number of chapters also increases thank you